when he first brought the phrase doses of mimosas, champagne, and cocaine to me, I heard that and I was like, dude, we're going to have to show our moms this song. Are you serious? With that being said, it's not my most favorite lyric that I've ever written, but hearing my parents sing that song is the most entertaining thing to me. Favorite place in the world is anywhere our little dog Clyde is. We always say you gotta be the first person to believe in yourself, because if you don't, nobody else is gonna want to. Man, music music today is really inspiring to me just because all the, the doors and boundaries have been completely broken down. You know, things like the internet and new technology have just really opened the doors to whatever ideas anybody has up here, you know? So it's like creativity is no longer limited. There are no real gatekeepers. Every everybody has access to everybody else. So it's it's really awesome being in, you know, the music industry and music scene right now just because there's no rules. The more music is progressing, the less people are worried about genre and that's really important I think because it allows musicians just to focus on making music rather than a, a particular sound and that leaves a really wide open space for just anything to happen. If I could own like six acres of land and I could build a commune that we all just kind of like lived and survived together and lived off the land and turn cherub into like cherub strawberries, cherub peaches, cherub we can make puddings, we can make rice, cherub apple trees, so then we can make applesauce, corn for cornbread. I think that that would be awesome. What's yours, man? Man, that is the dream. That's the dream right there. That's the American dream. That's the cherub dream. Are you into long distance relationships or?